Are you as excited as I am for I'm vacation? I'm always excited. You're excited for vacay? I'm excited for vacation. Ow. Guys, I'm really excited. It is vacation. We are down the shore. And I am, needless to say, very pumped. I brought a lot of makeup because Mike and I are going out to dinner tonight. We're going to one of our favorite restaurants, Angelica's in Seabright. It is delicious. I'm going to eat a lot, but also it's date night and I definitely want to beat my face. Look at the lighting in here. It's like really, it's like dreamy. Oh my God. I'm so happy. Vacation. We're off. We're down the shore for the next, what's today? Today is Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. We're going to be here for the next like three and a half days. Yes. It's Labor Day weekend, baby, and I'm ready. This is my favorite part. When I get here and I just open up all of the windows, it's like, let there be light. And then I get really upset when we're leaving and Mike puts all of the shades down. It's like highly depressing. I hate it, I hate it, but guess what? It's vacation and we're here to stay. Oh, yes. Did you hear? Did you hear? We're on vacation. Yeah. Do you need help? Ugh, responsibilities on vacation. Damn it. This is the vibe of vacation. So I just lathered myself in sunscreen because SPF is always the vibe for me. This is all of the makeup that I brought down in addition to the makeup that I have down here already. Um, I wanted to do, I wanted to show you guys what I was packing, but we like really didn't have enough time and I like had so much to pack. This Exuviance that I bought at Ulta, Age Reverse Day Repair Sunscreen SPF 30. And so far, I like. I wanna get a little glowy and hoey, glowy hoey here. I'm gonna use the Suva Beauty Drops. I received these in my Ipsy bag. Featured them in an unboxing not too long ago. There's always room for makeup. I sometimes apply liquid highlighter over my sunscreen just to give like a glow. But it makes us look like so much more alive. And this is so subtle. Put some on my cupid's bow. Makes your lips look a little juicier. I spread it all over my top lip, honestly. This is one thing I always have in my bag, a spoolie. I'm trying to be a hot, stay at home wife on this vacation. Like sure, I'll help you build a chair. Sure, I'll laugh at all your funny jokes because honestly Mike is hysterical, but I'll laugh anyway, but. I'm just trying to have a hoey vacay. <laughs> oh my God, my dad's gonna watch this and get mad when I say bad things. Sorry, dad, don't watch this. Don't tell him to watch this, mom. All right, let's go see where my uh, hoey soon to be husband is. Well, you know, I, if I come home and get you early, you don't want to be on the beach, you know? Uh-huh. I'm going to be here all weekend, and I mentioned you staying here, and you know how mom gets. I'm not staying there. Hang out. Stay here for Saturday, and then leave Saturday night. Mike wants to spend his day, like, doing things, not just sitting yeah. at the beach, but I want to sit at the beach all day, so. All right. Great. We need to go find Miguel. What are you doing? Building the chair. You're building the chair. <laughs> Sure, I'll help you build a chair. You want help? Wow, that's a big ass chair. This is like, uh, what's that dog? Clifford. Clifford the chair. What's the other one? Is it red? Red, or for Nanny. Yeah, that's fine. Clifford and Nanny. You can name the other one. First drink of the summer. Of the summer. <laughs> I really wish, I wish we could rewind and this could be the first drink of summer, but cheers. First drink of Labor Day weekend by myself. Last night we did such a bad job at vlogging. We went to the venue. I kind of had like a temper tantrum. Like internally, pretty much. Mike knew it was happening internally, but it was internally, not so much at him. After we went to the venue, we came home. Mike cooked a lovely steak dinner for the two of us. And then we split a bottle of wine and he bought a 12 pack of chocolate chip cookies from ShopRite. I had five and he had seven. They were literally this big and we finished a bottle of wine. Needless to say, we were drunk and eating chocolate chip cookies. And then we went to bed at 9.30. So last, last night was epic. I'm gonna read a magazine outside on the deck. Right there. Right in that seat right there with my drink. Toodles. 
I think we can see the level of vacation mode that each of us are on. I'm like up here and you're like down here. But here's your drink. First drink of Labor Day weekend. White girl to the max. Bon and Vive Spike Seltzer. I'm actually a white girl, so makes sense for me. Cheers to you and your first drink, because we've been drinking without you. Right. <laughs> We say hi. We're at dinner. Okay. So awkward. <laughs> Risotto stuffed chicken. It looks good. It does look good. And I got the halibut. Yeah. What did we think about our dinner? You're cutting my head off again. Babe, I'm too short. Too short in the house. Ew. <laughs> My dinner was really good. How was yours? My dinner was good too. That's good. I'm glad. Delish. My dinner was so good because it was dinner with you. I want this zoom. The, the camera's drunk too. What's the deal? What's the vacation deal? We're gonna spend the whole, whole day, day at, at the, the beach. beach. The whole day. <laughs> I gotta promise. It's, it's on video, it's happening. It's and now we're going to the beach right now. What are you singing over there? What's that tune you gotta sing in? Why? That's so pretty. Go in the sunset. Oh, ah, uh, whoa, what the <laughs> freak was that? You pushed me. I didn't push you. You're so dramatic. All right, come on, we gotta take a selfie. All right. Come here. Come over here, senor. Golden hour. Mm. <laughs> Ow. I'm not taking a picture. Why not? It's a video. Oh. <laughs> I'll just wait for a picture. Look at how pretty that sunset is though. Oh, it looks like trash on this. Trash. No crying at the beach. <laughs> no crying at the beach. It's a happy, happy place. place. crazy how fast this water Wow, I love the summer. I'm so sad. Wow, I look awful. Mike and I got pretty drunk last night, went to dinner. Dinner was lovely. I hope I got some of our outing on the vlog. But woke up this morning and I worked out. I did a 30 minute Sydney workout, showered, have sunscreen on we're going to see bright beach the beach with the waves the real beach and my parents are coming to stay the night looking forward to it what am i doing i'm getting hair ties i look like a hot mess i need to put some little pig braids in do something to my hair on the way there and yeah so i'm not gonna bring my camera to the beach but i'll take some funny vlogs later when we're all hanging out back at the house outside down the block because i don't want to leave my camera in the sun all day so toodles see you then yeah all right, what are your last words in case you don't come back? Bon voyage. That's your last word? Not like, Worst case, I'll see it's you been real. Worst case, I'll see you in the city Tuesday morning. <laughs> Watch it go and I'm standing. All right, be careful. Remember your phone's in there. Watch out for boats. would die if he just like it. came back <laughs> yes <laughs> is he really coming back i don't know uh, he, he looks like i don't here. know uh, he's probably tired in that in that car he's probably fighting him and the, the boat's coming by him what happened you're going across <laughs> I thought you were going to Long Island, you told me yesterday. You did? Felt like you did, right? Are you good? Are you good? Yeah, The boats with the waves and the tide. What? The boats with the waves we get, weren't yeah. they? I got it. I got it. <laughs> you got what? Two times. A wave washed over the boat. <laughs> yeah. Are you serious? Oh, yeah. It might be all wet. Oh. Uh, I was gonna say those boats were kind of close to me. Yeah, they were. Yeah, you should put your phone in the bag. Oh my god. I is mean. It, is it waterproof? No. Oh, it's still on there. The burner rip. 
might be dead. The burner's dead. The, the one boat went by and the waves were like, and I was like, I said, there those boats are pretty close to us. Yeah, they were. Can you take this and drive off here? It's gonna have to be side quick. Yeah, otherwise we're gonna lose it. You're such a pain in my arse today. I'm back though. Arse. Drag my kayak. I'll tell you two things. The current is a lot stronger. Because I like looked up and I'm like, who did they go? Whatever. Like, We're going on a 12 mile bike ride down Sandy Hook. Very excited. It's very early. It's before 9 a.m. And for me, that is very early. I'm waiting for our captain to come down. All right, you're the captain of this bike ride. We'll see. Are you ready? As ready as we're gonna be. I'm a little. You think it'll be all right? What's the farthest we've rode a bike together? A mile. A mile? That's a lie.